Hey guys, it's Kiki, and I am back with another uh, home decor haul. This one includes items from I went back to Home Goods, uh, Hobby Lobby, Target, and Bath and Body Works. I think that's it. But anyway, I just wanted to share some stuff that I found and see if you know if you like it, where you can get it. So the first thing I got, I was really excited about this. Um, I went to Kirkland's and they had these really cute lamps and um, they're funny because it's got that Edison light. I don't know if you guys can see that very well or not, but I really like these and it's going to go really well in my living room when I get it done. I get furniture next week. I'm so excited. Um, <laughs> so I got that and then at Home Goods, I'm still in like fall decorating mode and I got, oh, I love this guy girl. She's a girl. She's got a dress on. Um, this little fox. Isn't she so cute? Um, I have a 10 year old in case you guys don't know. And so I have to include some kiddish things in my decorating. So I thought she was super fun. She's got a really cute little bow in her hair and I love her dress. I think I'm just going to have her sit on the staircase with some little, I have a little stuffed pumpkin that's gonna go next to her and I think we'll just do that, but I thought she was adorable. So that's my little fox. And then keeping with my fox theme, I found this one. And I think it's really, really cute, but I love it because it lights up. Oh, who doesn't need a lighted box? I need a lighted box. So there's that one and it was only $6.99, really nice. I thought that was fun. McKenna's gonna love that. And then also at Home Goods to put in my um candle. It's not a candelabra. My sconces in my dining room. I got these, and they've got some nice lattice work, but they are the um, battery operated LEDs. So I thought they would be really pretty up there, but then I, you know, I don't have to mess them up with real wax. So I got two of those. And then at Home Goods, I also got these knobs. They're uh, mercury glass knobs. And I love them. They are, oh, I thought these were Cynthia Rowley, but there's not. They did have a bunch of Cynthia Rowley brand knobs. But a neighbor gifted us, I mean, just out of the blue, they asked if we wanted an old desk. It's in perfect shape and it's never been painted or stained it's just raw wood but it's a really nice big work surface and it's just i don't know i don't even know what to call it it's not dark it's just raw wood but anyway i'm going to paint that and decorate it's going to go in my living room as well i was really excited because my craft room has tons of room for my craft table and my new stores that i got in there but i really didn't want to have to set up a place for our bills and to keep my um, important papers and things like that so now I have a spot I have this new desk and I'm going to paint that to go with the living room so when I do that I will post it but these knobs are for the desk I love them I think they're really pretty and then let's see oh one more. there we go I also just got this at home goods I thought it was really cute this little pad this is right on I love the scooter and the teal. So I got that one. And then for Hobby Lobby, I got a couple of little things just to go in my tiered tray for fall. So I got this. Thought it was really cute. I love the little scroll work on the pumpkin. And I got, oh, I got this. I think this one came from um, home, oh, Kirkland's actually, but it's cute. It says Pick Me. McKenna actually chose this one. And then Hobby Lobby, I got this little bird. Thought it was adorable. I like the sparkle in it, but it's gonna look really cute on the tray. And I got a big beige sunflower. Also nice and sparkly. And then I got some orange flowers to go in the tray. A couple of little fall accent pieces also. And I got, I love candles. This one is white pumpkin vanilla. It's just a, a mini. This is when all their fall stuff was um, half off last week. So this one smells really good. So 
who knows if I'll ever burn it because I want it to look cute <laughs> in my tray. But um, anyway, got that one. And then a Bath and Body Works. I went last week with my daughter when she was here. It's kind of, that's something we do on September 1st every year is we, we um, like to go to Bath and Body Works and stack up on the candles, but we weren't gonna be together this year because I'm in Texas and she's in Colorado. So we went uh, while she was here last week and we got, I got a few things. I'm sure I'll go back for more, but um, their packaging, I think they up their packaging every year. I really, really like it, but Anyway, I got, um, I'm a sucker for the embossed leaf, but this one is sweater weather. And this one has like, it's got kind of a minty smell to it, but it also really reminds you of fall. So I think that one's wonderful. Let's see what it says. Sage, juniper berry, eucalyptus. That's probably what I'm smelling and associating with the mint and fresh woods. This one smells really nice. I love this one and it smells clean. And then I also got this one. This is mahogany teak wood. It's not a new scent or anything, but this one I love and I already started burning this one. It smells like a man. It smells like my husband. <laughs> so anyway, I just, I love it because it smells like a man. So that's it. That's all. That's all I have to say about that one. And then this one, Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. This one's going to make me hungry, but I love the packaging again. There's a box. I must have a box thing going this year. So, and I love the embossed pumpkin. I hate getting rid of these. I have a hard time parting with them, so I never burn them all the way down. I get them down to about here, and then I refuse to burn them anymore. I just hoard them. I tell my husband they're great for if we have a power outage, but we never have a power outage. So anyway, this one smells like some yummy dessert. Fresh pumpkin, warm caramel, grated cinnamon, and vanilla bean. How could you go wrong? And then, let's see, I went to, oh, Hobby Lobby. I got this really cute tear tray. I love the texture on this one. It feels really rough and there's spots on it that look rusty. And this one I'm actually going to put on my table here. And then if you've seen my other one, um, kind of looks like a printer's tray and it, re and it uh, revolves and it's got all these little pockets. That one's gonna go in my craft room. I figured that one would be really good for seasonal things. Uh, you know, I can put all my Christmas embellishments in it when it's Christmas time, change it out for Valentine's Day, you get it. So anyway, this one's gonna replace the other one. I thought this was really cute and this was half off as well. So only pay 12 bucks for it. And then for the coffee table, I'm gonna get someday. I got this and it's gonna be home to, you know, candles and a few books and stuff like that to sit on the coffee table. But just a galvanized metal tray. Not, I, I think it's big, but I don't think it's humongous because I'm going to have to get a really large um, coffee table. So the room is really big. So if I put a dinky coffee table in there, it's gonna look ridiculous. And then let me see what else. Oh, I hit Target today because last night I painted my crafting. All I have to do is the uh, cutting in on the ceiling tonight, and then I'll be done. And this weekend, my plan is to unpack my craft room and get it moved in there. The only thing I'm not, if I have time, I'll do it, but I've got to stain my big table that's going in there. But I'm going to be able to unpack it, and I'm so excited about that because I'm so ready to do Halloween scrapbook pages and Halloween pocket letters and things like that, and I'm really itching to get in there. So, um... Maybe in the dollar spot, they have, I don't know if you guys will be able to see it. It's a really cute alphabet tape, and it's cursive writing. This I got for the teacher in me for my planner. And then, because my craft room is teal, um, I couldn't pass up the little teal paper clips and the teal thumbtacks. And then, let's see, I got... But these were really cute. These are going to be awesome for glitter. Um, these little glass jars. These were actually three bucks, but there's five in a package. So those will be fun. And then, oh, let me grab. 
got, I just got a bunch of these. I got the teal ones and I got gray and white striped ones because my craft room is teal and gray and white. So I got these. I'm really, really excited. I do have the um, nine uh, space cubicles. I got two of them for my craft room. So I've got to fill one up with drawers and leave one empty for display and scrapbook paper pads and things like that. But other than that, I think that's it for my haul this time. So until next week, right? Okay. Uh, so y'all have a good week. Thanks for watching. I will talk to you later. Bye.